you were the hero of Jets Twitter. Cos became a hero. <laughs> he basically put Bart Scott in a body bag, Willie. We want to send our thoughts and prayers. Um, he said you and Leger were nice guys, but uh, Bart, not as many kind words for him. But some of it, I think people were thinking, is this, you know, a rating? You know, you watch, you want to say something controversial. SMY says, you know, it's say something strong to get some feedback. I think some people might have thought that side of things like, all right, this might blow up if we say it. Let's uh, let's bring in some ratings. No, 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 no. I don't no. listen. I Bar's my brother. Absolutely, we, we were fierce rivals. I never played with him with, uh, when he was with the Jets. I've grown to love him, and I've grown to love his fearlessness. Um, and sometimes it comes off as Atlantish and crash and in your face and a little bit out, off-putting. But I also think that's him being true to who he is. If you know Bar Scott off the field, that that's that's who you're seeing. So um, I I don't. I think I think sometimes, man. One thing I think, and Brian can help me here. I think some guys, when they leave the field, they romance about who they are in their careers. I don't think that's Bart. I think Bart was a hell of a linebacker. I think he played at a high level. He played with a lot of Hall of Famers. He was in some big time games, and so and he's extremely smart. Like I, I tell Bart all the time, you're, you're wasting your talents on air. Bart should have a headset and be on the sideline coaching linebackers and coaching defense. Because he can dissect and he knows, like, I don't know if he can get be like a conciliatory to uh, the, the, the Jets defensive coordinator, but he should be. The guy is a brilliant mind and he's, and he's, and he's, you know, he doesn't, he doesn't, he's not afraid to cut onions. And sometimes I think when athletes get in this space, um, they're act, they access to cut onions. That wasn't S and Y. What you saw, what you saw Sunday was us really having an emotional reaction to what we heard and what we saw. Um, and to those who felt like we were out of bounds and not, and listen, once again, it wasn't personal. It was us just reacting to the moment. And, um, you know, it is what it is. Cos won't be getting any, uh, birthday presents from Bart. I was not getting one from Bart anyway. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. 